A recent Katie Joy post. So people ask me why I don't like Unirock. There are a million reasons. But most recently, it's his incessant and hateful retweets about transgender youth that I find repulsive and disgusting. I am shocked given that he has transgender followers that he would be this hateful. I go to Thailand. I want to find someone to give me a happy ending. A chick with a dick? Unirock attacks Keffels, tweets negatively about transitioning, transgender bathroom rights, and regulatory takes transphobic positions. He falsely labels Keffels as a predator. He's basically taking Kiwi Farms positions on transgender people. I spoke out because my longtime moderator is transgender. I have no clue if she has any idea that Unirock acts this way on Twitter. I think many people who follow him have no clue his ugliness on Twitter. Katie referred earlier to her having a trans moderator. Hi, that's me. I'm Scarlett. My thing with Gabby. But... So you like Scat or he? She like Gat. I'm sorry. It's all right. So you like Scat. So you like Scat. So you like Scat. I'm sorry, Scarlett. I love you. On a video Katie did about the sister wives, someone asked if one of the daughters was married to a woman, and for some reason Katie replied yes. I don't know if she was confused or if she really thinks Tony is a woman. A chick with a dick? No, hey, shh, Todd. What? You, no, you don't say that. Oh really? <laughs> no. Is it? That's not. That's not a. Yes, th that's yes, Todd. <laughs> Is that a derogatory name? Yes, it is! Okay. And she looks like she's a, a drag queen. You don't say that. Like, that's so rude. I'm having trouble determining if it's a man or a woman. I know you keep saying it's a woman, but it looks like a man to me. We respect their pronouns. We respect their identity. And we just respect them as humans. It looks like a man to me. Gabby can't stop misgendering and calling Trisha she over and over and over again. People keep like telling her like it's they them. 12 seconds later. Because I know with Trisha she talks about how there are times where she feels we're not a fan of Peyton misgendering anyone. We should always respect people's pronouns in my opinion and we should always be respectful of what their names are and not using their dead names. Just reading a message from Elliot Page, formerly Ellen Page, who just recently came out as transgender. It takes zero seconds to be respectful to somebody's pronouns, really. I will not ever condone anyone that uses their platform to target, harass, and send hate to transgender people. A chick with a dick? Also, seeing his ride or die say that no one takes me seriously is laughable and deflection. The fact that I'm cited in media outlets regulatory speaks for itself. Okay, first of all, it is regularly, not regulatory, regularly. Second, no one takes you seriously because you've been sued four times for defamation. Who has credibility issues? It's not me. and you have not won a single one of those. Two have settled and got exactly what they wanted out of you. One was to give up a source and to delete your entire second channel and all your videos about them, and the other one you are legally not allowed to talk about anymore. So in my opinion, they won. She needs to get off her soapbox and look at her own actions. Fuck off, Lizzie. I hope you like, fuck off, Lizzie.